welcome to another episode of Real Estate Investing Explained. Here's today's question. So are mobile homes a good alternative for new investors to get started, or might it be better for them to start off with a more traditional property first? There's so many ways that people can make money in real estate, multifamily, single family, and strategies, niches, sub niches. It's interesting, even with mobile homes, the sub niches within mobile home investing, but that's not right for everybody. I mean, some people, if you don't want to get started with mobile homes, you might get want to get started with a mobile home park or you feel comfortable doing something else. I'd say it's more of the local supply and demand, what you want to start getting into, what excites you, what you're maybe passionate about and what's realistic. How much capital do you have? How much knowledge do you have? Mobile homes in parks and on private land, they do offer something currently, and this may change in the future, but currently they do offer pros and cons. We can get into these properties for not that much money. There's not too much competition. We're dealing with people that they need our help on the buying side when we're buying these homes, they're struggling. And when we sell homes, we're selling to good, hardworking people as well. And just seeing that like struggle and helping people, and it's really cool. It kind of keeps you humbled and grounded in this business. That's all for this episode of Real Estate Investing Explained. Be sure to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook, or subscribe to our YouTube channel to get even more free content.